feel like the reason why a lot of NBA players get tats is because of the culture. Also, it's like expressions of themselves and their bodies on like a major stage. You know, your name is on the jersey. You can still express yourself through the tattoos. I feel like tattooing is just becoming a prominent thing in the world now. It's just becoming accepted. It used to be so taboo to be tattooed, you know, and now it's becoming a part of our culture. It's in music, it's in fashion, like everybody's incorporating it somehow. You know, it's nice to have a sport where you are able to even have that many tattoos. And I feel like that's kind of a plus because there's other sports or like other careers that people can't. I don't think they're getting tattoos because they're in the NBA. They're just getting tattoos because I feel like tattoos are becoming much more accepted. I blame Allen Iverson for that. I remember when Allen Iverson started that whole epidemic of tattoos in the league and Dennis Rodman. You can't forget about Dennis Rodman when he started wilding out and everybody just started going towards that too. He was setting a bar for a lot of people, I feel like. Just his whole swag and like style was just always off the wall. And uh, I feel like he really was the first person who I can remember to really be like tatted up OD. Top three most tatted players. I'm gonna start off with Chris Anderson because he actually has good work, the Birdman. Second, I'm gonna go with my man Wilson Chandler. Wilson Chandler got a lot of tats too. The other homie, New York Nick own J.R. Smith. I feel like I've been seeing a lot of the back rockers. You know, LeBron has his obnoxious chosen one. Kevin Durant has his big Maryland one going across his back. I feel like that's really big and popular. Yeah, I think the percentage of NBA players who have tattoos are continuously growing year after year because tattoos becoming, you know, part of the day-to-day -day now. It doesn't change the person who they are, you know, they're just expressing themselves.